Hey everybody, it's Space Coast. Sunrise down here at Melbourne Beach, across from the fire station on A1A. Uh, a couple fishermen down here with me today, fishing north of me. Uh, they got here a little earlier than I did, and I saw all I've seen them catch so far is catfish, but I've got uh, two smaller rods out and the two big rods out on the north and south, and we're gonna see what happens. The water's clear, so we might be able to get on some fish today. See what happens. So the first fish of the day is a pompano down here at Melbourne Beach on the 23rd of July. It's undersized, so we're going to get it off and get it sent back. We're catching a pompano this week down here at Melbourne Beach. That first fish of the day, it's a pompano. It's undersized, so we're going to send it back. Get out here, we can get it away from Mr. Fred here. He's standing by trying to get him. Get him sent back. Come see me when you're bigger, buddy, all right? Melbourne Beach on the 23rd of July. Uh, pretty good fish action, lots of bites. Lots of catfish though. Water's good, but lots of catfish. Got a catfish on this rod. You back up, and then if you look right down here, I'm going to be using this guy for live bait. Horn belly. Caught him up close, so I'm going to put this guy on the hook, and maybe we can get on a big nook or a big tarpon or something. But we're going to give this guy a try live. Just caught a horn belly. I'm going to use him for live bait. He's going to be the perfect size. He's only about five or six inches long. We're going to get him off the hook and get him sent out. Maybe we can get on something nice like a tarpon or a snook. Just caught the first shark of the day, a little bonnet head. Going to get him off the hook and get him sent back. Catching, all of a sudden the fish just started biting. Had three, four rods going at once. So the bite's coming on. It's about 8.15. Put that little bonnet head back. Got him off the hook. Like I said, he's about, uh, this one's probably close to two feet long. So not a bad catch, but we don't keep any of these bonnet heads. We don't eat them. Come back and see me when you're bigger, dude. Raking some sand fleas down here. Got a couple of them in here that are big ones, thumb size. I may put those out and send them way, way out there and see if we can get on a black drum or something. But catching a few sand fleas down here at uh, Melbourne Beach on the 23rd of July. Getting ready to pack it up. It's a little after 10. People are coming to the beach, so I'm going to get off the beach. But I uh, just caught this mahara. I'm pretty sure the mahara will start biting now, too, because it's starting around 10.30. It was supposed to pick up on the bite. But when the beachgoers come, I start getting off the beach. I don't want to be interfering with all that. So get this guy off the hook and get him sent back. Baby pompano keep washing up in the on the beach and leave themselves stranded. I don't understand why keep picking them up and throwing them back. Come back and see me when you're bigger, dude. Hey everybody, Space Coast coming to you from Melbourne Beach, Holland Park, across from the fire station. Got fishing right at daylight about 6.30, 6.40. Uh, started catching catfish immediately with a, uh, caught a few small pompano, no big pompano, all of them under eight inches. Got a little video of that. Caught mahara horn bellies, a few small whiting, but the story of the day is mostly catfish. Caught a couple bonnet head sharks. Uh, looked like I had a strike on the big rod, but it, if it did, it picked it up and dropped it immediately. So it's kind of a strange day, but we did catch fish and we did catch a few little sharks. So if you want to have some fun and spend some time with your family at the beach, you might want to head down here to Melbourne Beach. As always, everybody, be safe, tight line.